Okay, so let's solve this topic. So finding the derivative of exponential functions and these are the formulas to find the derivative of exponential functions. So for the derivative of e to the power u, that's e to the power u times the derivative of u. And for a to the power u, that's a to the power u times ln a times the derivative of u. So for this given, u is equal to 2x minus 3. And for the derivative of u, so for the derivative of 2x, that's 2. And for the derivative of negative 3, that's 0. So du is equal to 2. So to find out the derivative, so using this formula, that's e to the power u. So we have e to the power 2x minus 3 times the derivative of u. So du is equal to 2. So therefore, y prime is equal to 2 times e to the power 2x minus 3. So this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so u is equal to 4 minus 2x to the power 3. And for the derivative of u, so this one is 0. And for the derivative of negative 2x to the power 3, so we have negative, then multiply this 2 times 3, that's 6, then x, minus 1 for the exponent, that's to the power 2. So to find out the derivative, so we have y prime equals e to the power u, that's e to the power 4, minus 2x to the power 3, times the derivative of u, so that's negative 6x to the power 2. Then y prime is equal to negative 6x to the power 2 times e to the power 4 minus 2x to the power 3. So this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so using the product rule, so this one is u, this one is v. So u times v equals v times the derivative of u plus u times the derivative of v. So u is equal to x squared and the derivative of u, so the derivative of x squared, that's 2x. Then for v, that's e to the power 3x to the power 2 minus 4x. And for the derivative of v, so using this formula, so we have e to the power 3x to the power 2 minus 4x times the derivative of u. So since the derivative of 3x to the power 2, this one is 6x. Then for the derivative of negative 4x, that's negative 4. So to find out the derivative, so using this formula, so we have v. So v is e to the power 3x to the power 2 minus 4x times the derivative of u, that's 2x, then plus u, so u is x squared, times the derivative of v, so we have e to the power 3x to the power 2, minus 4x, times 6x, minus 4. Then to simplify, so we have this, 2x times e to the power 3x to the power 2 minus 4x then plus so distribute this x squared so this one is 6x to the power 3 and negative 4x to the power 2 times e to the power 3x to the power 2 minus 4x so this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so using this formula, so u is equal to 5x and for the derivative of u, that's 5. So we have y prime equals a to the power u. So that's 3 to the power 5x times ln a. So a is 3 times the derivative of u, so times 5, so y prime is equal to 5, 
times 3 to the power 5x times ln3. So this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so u is equal to 4x squared minus 5. And for the derivative of u, so since the derivative of 4x squared, this one is 8x and this one is 0. Then using this formula to find the derivative, so we have y prime equals a to the power u. So that's 7 to the power 4x squared minus 5. Then ln a, so ln 7 times the derivative of u, that's 8x. So we have now y prime is equal to 8x times 7 to the power 4x squared minus 5 times ln 7. So this is now the derivative. Then for this given, so u is equal to 3x minus 2x squared. And for the derivative of u, so the derivative of 3x, that's 3. Then minus the derivative of 2x squared, so multiply this 2 times 2. That's 4x, so minus 1 for the exponent. Then using this formula to find the derivative, so we have y prime equals 6 to the power 3x minus 2x squared times ln 6 times the derivative of u, so 3 minus 4x. Or we can rewrite this one as 3 minus 4x times 6 to the power 3x minus 2x to the power 2 times ln6. So this is now the derivative.